this is a fun project and it uses the color green. We used yellow for our bumblebee and we used blue for our Pete the cat. And you put yellow and blue together and they make green. That's right. We're going to make a green sea turtle. So I already went ahead and we're using a coffee filter for this project. Just a plain old coffee filter. And if you don't have that, just use paper. You can use green paper or you can color your paper green with whatever you have. I decided to use the coffee filter and I painted it green, covering the whole thing. I took my time and I made sure that every little bit was green. No little bits of the white showing. Now I need the turtle to live somewhere. Now I'm gonna put him in the sea. So the sea or the ocean is blue. So I'm gonna put him here. And you can glue that down. And then when you come back and you've got that done, I'll show you what's next. All right, I've got mine on there. Wow, that looks like the world. That's a good way to make the world also. Now, that turtle, maybe he's hiding in his shell. And maybe we need to have him come out. Could we say, come on out, turtle? One, two, three. Come on out, turtle. Hello, Mr. Turtle. I'm gonna show you how I made this. Isn't he cute? Here we go, let's get to work. All right, and for the head, we're gonna use an egg carton. And all I did was open it up. And you see one of these? Kind of looks like a turtle head. So you're just gonna have mom and dad cut that out carefully for you, as much around it as they can to get as much of that head. And then you're gonna paint all of it green or color it with markers or crayons. So I just take the egg carton piece and I'm coloring it all green. Mr. Turtle, or Mrs. Turtle, it's all green. You can make it light green or dark green, like I'm using. It could be different shades of green. And if you really don't want the turtle to have a green head, that's okay too. In art, it's okay to make it any color you want to. There's Mr. Turtle's head. We need Mr. Turtle to have a face. So we're gonna add a face when it dries and I'll show you what's next. Okay friends, so now you can add little paper circles to his head to make the eyes. And then we'll just use a marker to put a little small black circle in the middle of the white circle for his eyes. Just like that. Now, is Mr. Turtle a happy turtle or a sad turtle? You can choose and make him happy or sad. I'm gonna give him a happy little smile. Just like that. <laughs> He's in the water swimming, but he needs his legs and his tail. Okay, just four little shapes like this. That'll be his feet that are sticking out from under his shell. I'll show you what that looks like. Put two up at the top and two at the back. Tuck those in there. And gotta attach his head yet. I'll show you. See? And now we're just gonna add his tail, which is gonna be a triangle shape. Okay, and I'm just gonna use some of the pieces that I was cutting before. I'm just gonna give him a long thin tail. It's gonna be a long triangle 
triangle shape. Add that at the back. I glue it down and I'll show you what it looks like. All right, the easiest way for me is just to put tape on the inside of the turtle toward his face and then tape it down into place. And then you see Mr. Turtle swimming in the sea. There he goes. Have a fun trip, Turtle. Ooh. Where is he going to swim? What is he going to see when he's in the ocean? I wonder. Bye-bye. See you next time. Have fun making a turtle. I can't wait to see what it looks like.